Meteorologist Sean Sublett from the Richmond Times-Dispatch. The Brandon Mill Woods A1 Weather Minute this Thursday is a wet one. We'll have rain most of the day, upwards of about an inch before it winds down this evening. It turns very windy on Friday, but just as important, the temperatures on Friday will drop during the course of the day. So let's start with today. Our temperatures largely in the mid and upper 30s heading out the door. So what we have falling from the sky, largely just rain from about the first part of the day into the evening. The kind of orange and pink shades farther off to the west, they're going to have some ice once again across the Blue Ridge Parkway, Skyline Drive, Roanoke Valley, Shenandoah Valley. Lasting through about lunchtime should not be catastrophic problems at all. And then going into the afternoon, the temperatures everywhere nudge into the 40s, perhaps even low 50s, for the rain ends during the evening and gives us a fairly quiet period of weather, at least for Thursday night. Friday, however, We'll have one final little burst of rain, maybe an hour or so, and then the temperatures will plummet during the course of Friday. We'll start in the 40s first thing in the morning, but by lunchtime or 1 o'clock, it'll be down into the 20s on the heels of a very strong west wind, 15 to 30 miles an hour with some higher gusts. That's put, a, put the wind chills in the 20s, if not teens, during Friday afternoon. We're down to 10 on Friday night and Saturday night, we'll still have some 10 and 20 mile an hour winds around those nights as well. So the wind chills down around zero. And even with the sun out Saturday and Sunday, highs are going to be in the 20s to about 30, which will make for a very cold, unfortunately, uh, not a white Christmas day. And be sure to stay with us on social media for updates and subscribe to the Richmond Times-Dispatch. Get our videos for free right to your phone using the Virginia Video Network app.